Hello, 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 sweet loves. Welcome back to Sweets Unmuted. I thank you guys for tapping in with your girl Sweets, okay? So we're going to get into a quick element reading for my water signs. That's Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio, okay? Holy Spirit, I surrender my mind, body, and spirit to you in this moment. I ask that you use me as you will. Use me as a vessel to convey the messages that you need to be conveyed to my water signs at this time. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. So, off the bat, before I even get any cards out, you guys see this card is here, right? Setting clear boundaries. So, it's here because I don't know what's going on um, within your energy, but you could be experiencing several delays or several interruptions at this time when i tell you guys i literally started this video over four times now the um synchronistic events that took place in me trying to do the reading multiple times when i initially sh started and i shuffled i seen this card setting clear boundaries did the reading was interrupted started over and clear boundaries came out again Started the reading, interrupted, started over. But I left this here because it came back out. So some of you guys could definitely need to set clear boundaries, okay, with an individual. Someone that you may need to set clear boundaries with. What else do you have, Spirit? What do you have for my water signs? Strength, yeah. You're going to have to have the strength to set firm boundaries with someone. This is your chance. Go for it. Do it. Don't play it safe. Anything worth having is worth going after. Okay? So your ancestors are guiding you to have strength and set clear boundaries. And honestly, what I'm getting in all areas of your life. Okay? Okay? This may be, this reading may be about an actual person. It may be about just you in general. But someone is needing, or you guys are needing to have strength. If this resonates for you, you're needing to have strength to set clear boundaries. You know, if you've been delaying things or, and like I said, there could be delays. There could be interruptions. You could have been delaying setting clear and firm boundaries with someone. But Spirit is saying now is the time, okay? Now is the time because things are coming and happening within your life, okay? Your material world and, and, and you're expanding materially and spiritually. And in order for this to come in, you have to set firm boundaries, okay? You have to set firm boundaries to, to be able to withstand and, you know, sustain your wish fulfillment, those things that you've been wishing for and manifesting. Okay. So a snake that poorly judged you could be looking you up at this time, could be trying to see what you got going on. Okay. This is someone who poorly judged you. Okay. They must ain't know who you was. And this could be who you have to set clear boundaries with. Yeah, why? Because this person has hidden intentions and desires. Things are hidden about this person. You don't know their real intentions. Yeah, look, someone's living in fear. Now, now you could be living in fear. This living in fear could actually be you with the strength card. If this isn't you, this could be Another individual, this individual who poorly judged you, this could be them living in fear because at the bottom, we got courthouse. So take it where it resonates. But someone is living in fear and needing to have strength. What else do we have, Spirit? Mm-hmm. This could be involving some type of family situation for some of you with the six of cups here and page of cups okay this is giving me all right if you look at this it's a lady and a child and it's 
a man here. So this could be a family situation. You could have had a family or had a child by someone that's very immature. This person wants to offer you something or wants to offer you their emotions, but this person is very childish, okay? They're very childish. We got the sun here. So this snake sees you as their happiness. They see you as their end-all, be-all. But this person is immature, This person is immature and childish. I'm just getting the energy of a joker. I don't know. I keep looking at this cup and I just see the joker. Mm-hmm. Look. This, for some of you guys, take it where it resonates. This could be some type of family situation. Someone is dealing with anxiety behind a ten of cups situation, behind a family situation. Somebody that they what? Seen happiness, which explains why we had the sun car here. Right. This is what this person is dealing with because their happiness is more than likely gone. With this snake here, this person is, is depressed behind this situation. And that's where this fear is coming from. Yeah, this is someone who only thought about themselves. You could have put more effort and time and energy into this connection than they did. Thank you. It was, I knew it was going to come out because I seen it. Okay. This is a charmer. This is someone who likes to come in and love bomb. And this is why you're needing to have the strength. Okay. To set firm boundaries because this King of Cups is about to come in. If they haven't already, they're going to come in love bombing, trying to charm you. Because they're scared and they're living in fear and having anxiety and depression behind losing this family situation that makes them happy. Now, you could be someone who is, um, you could be someone who's, let's say, um, I want to say like easily swayed in so many ways. You know, this person's love bomb and energy could typically work for you. You know, not work for you, but work on you. Them doing this could typically work. But if you're already in this energy of having strength, having the strength to set clear, firm boundaries with this person, that's what may have them living in fear. Okay? But someone is trying to charm another person. And, a, and one individual is needing the strength to reject the other. To reject this love bomber. Yeah, look, look, they're going to come in trying to love bomb you with a gift, which, which, which explains, okay, which explains the giving here, okay? So for some, this could be a family situation. For others, it may be someone that you just see as family or that you are close with. But someone wants to offer another person something, okay? We have, we are divine counterparts. Someone wants to gift you with something. Now, this is a part of some charming energy, okay? This may actually be them wanting to give this box a small. Maybe they want to gift you with just something, you know, sentimental. Maybe it is some type of proposal or offer with we are divine counterparts okay but this person is a snake okay double confirmation in this reading spirit really wants you to notice about someone okay this person is a snake this person with this gift and this uh six of cup here six of cups here this person could have been offering cups to multiple people which explains why they're the snake but they see you as their happiness okay but be on alert because the chariot is here, which means this is movement. This person is coming towards you, okay? This person is coming towards you, and if they haven't, they could be moving towards dealing with some type of depression for their snaky energy if it, this isn't their current energy. But that's all I have for you guys, sweet loves. Tell a friend and tell a friend. Book a read with sweets, okay? Love and light to you all, sweet loves. Good day.